Welcome back to PhD TV, and today is part one of my fiance rating my fragrances. So basically what we'll be doing, and it's gonna be a series of episodes, maybe about six fragrances, and she's gonna rate them to see which one she likes best. And after she does each and every single one of them, the ones that won each round will go head to head to see which one is the best of the entire collection. But something to know here is that Jimmy Choo, man, will not be on this list because this is her absolute favorite. Therefore, this is gonna be omitted from the list because she can smell this out. I'm actually going to put Jimmy Choo man into the competition. She just doesn't know that yet. So we're really gonna see if Jimmy Choo is the man or not. So basically, that's about it. In between each and every single few fragrances, we do have a little cup of coffee right here. Just so that between each fragrance, she can have her nose refreshed and neutralized of any other fragrance. So that each judgment will be accurate and genuine depending on what fragrance that she's smelling. Without much else being said, let's get started. This is my fiance rating my fragrances. First one. Ooh, I like this one. I like this one a lot. It's um, it's very fresh feeling. Uh, maybe like right out of the shower, put it on. Maybe we're going out on a lunch date or good like a daytime use, very fresh, very, um, very clean. I think I've already said that, but maybe not like a date night, like a nighttime scent, like where you're putting on a suit and tie going out to a five-star restaurant. Maybe not that, but I really like it. I feel like it's a good everyday scent. I rate this one a, well, since I don't have anything before it, I'm going to give it a solid 7.2. Smell in my coffee grounds. All right, next one. Um, this one smells like cleaner. <laughs> I mean, it's not horrible. It really does smell like cleaner. My first instinct was like you sprayed Lysol on this. <laughs> it's it's a very clean scent, but it's very much a cleaner. I don't know what you would wear this with. I mean, it's okay. It's not my favorite. It's like, I feel like you just clean the house and that's what you smell like after you've been working with Lysol or you've been working with Febreze. Okay, yeah, I I'm gonna give this one maybe like a four just because it's like it smells good. It smells like a clean house, but it does smell like <laughs> that you just sprayed Lysol on you. Next one. Okay. Oh, I like this one. This one's very light. Like none of these are very spicy, I feel like. I like this one. This one is, um, I may be completely wrong with this, but this might, it, it, it reminds me of like a woody scent. <laughs> Granted, I don't have a trained nose. I'm not very good at picking up a fragrance. I just know what I like and what I don't like. So, especially on uh, Philip on him. So, yeah, I like this. I. What's funny is that you don't like that on me. Really? You, you've told me you've not liked that one. Oh, that's really awkward. But, um, yeah, this one smells really good. I could see, I could see a guy wearing this, like, out on a date night. I think if you're wanting to dress up a little bit, give yourself a little flair, then you could, uh, you could definitely pull this off. I'm gonna give this one, just by smelling it on here, I'm gonna give it a six and a half. I, I, I like it. I'm not in love with it, but I do like it. All right, here's the next one. Ooh, this one smells really good. This one's very, very sweet. Um, wow, that that smells really nice. This would be a great like, <laughs> a great like everyday wear. But you could de it depends on what you're wearing and what the occasion is that you could pull it off in different scenarios. So like, I could definitely see you like putting it on just to go on like a movie night or just to go out to the grocery store. But if you also wanted to jazz it up, I feel like if you're wearing like a suit and a tie, or if you're dressing up and you're going out to dinner. Dinner, then I think that it would give off that very professional smell, maybe like uh, a dressier smell. If you like sweet, then this is definitely for you. I guess my taste is like a clean slash sweet scent, but I really like this one. Yeah, I'm giving this one an 8.2. I like this one a lot. This one's not very aromatic, I guess, right word. Again, I'm not a professional with this. Like I'm having a hard time smelling it. I almost smell just paper and I know this is like very drenched but yeah I'm not a big fan because I can barely smell it I don't really know how else to describe it maybe a little like woodsy I guess like a little outdoorsy I mean I guess if we're going out to like walk the dog <laughs> or something I don't know <laughs> cut that out don't put that in there anyway yeah I don't like this one it's just it's not catching my attention I think it's a little too maybe like woodsy for me like it, to me it gives off like a very dark scent like I feel like this is gonna come out in a dark bottle this might be completely wrong, but not my favorite. I'm giving this one like a three. Coffee, I'm rating a 10. All right, uh, that's the last one. Um, this one smells good. This one smells a little older. Um, instead of like a younger type scent, like I feel like if you're 
um, maybe in your 30s and up, this smells like you. I mean, it smells very good. It's got like a very, uh, maybe like a musky scent, like a very spicy scent. I, I, I enjoy it, but maybe if you're on the younger, um, this wouldn't be the scent for you. It does give off that very mature vibe that you're going for. I do like it a lot. Um, again, it's very spicy, but it does give off a very mature scent. And I feel like if you were to wear this, this is like a very business professional type scent, something that you would wear to work if you're working in an office setting or if you're wanting to have a very aromatic scent and want someone to notice you. Um, I feel like that's what this would be. I do like it. I'm gonna give this one a seven. All right, so we have the scores right here. So the winner of the comp of the main competition here is Blue Day Chanel. Just to clarify, we all know this monster right here. But the real winner of this competition <laughs> is no no other than Jimmy Choo. I did put it in here. You knew that Jimmy still wins, <laughs> even when Always. she doesn't even know she she knew. I told her this was not in the competition. <laughs> I threw it in here to see if it would actually be the best in the line for this competition. It won. So congratulations, Jimmy. But for furthering competition, Blue Day Chanel. Because now that she knows Jimmy's in, she's not going anywhere else. So Blue Day Chanel moves forward. Did I really vote Jimmy the highest? Eight point two. This was just like a seven. No, this is like. <laughs> Jimmy! You guys, thank you so much for watching PhD TV. It was awesome sitting here and getting to know you. Um, I had a lot of fun doing this fragrance competition, so tune in next time so that we can continue this fragrance competition and we can go through um, all of his fragrance collection. Make sure you hit that like button, comment down below, turn on the notification so you know whenever he posts another video, and comment down below. Thanks so much, guys! Jimmy! <laughs>